Hello everyone, I am Ricky DePriest for Willapon Photography, located outside of Paris, Tennessee. This morning I'd like to show you how to change the format of your files. Say you've went out and shot a wedding or a sports event or a number of different things and you come back with 500 or 1,000 or 2,000 pictures, but yet you want to put a few up on the web immediately and the thought of going through 2,000 pictures and being able to change the format so that you can upload that is quite daunting. There's a fast and easy way in Photoshop that allows you to do that. So as you can see we're in the TIFF format and these four sample pictures that we have and you can also see the size 66 megabytes, 103 megabytes, quite large. So what we want to do is to be able to change this from a TIFF to a JPEG. So it's quite simple. Select all the pictures, select one, and then holding the shift key, select all. Once you have that, you'd come up to the tools, come down to Photoshop, and image processor. Step one. And select the files. I was telling you we've got all four files selected. Then step two, where's the location that we're going to store these in? And so, as you can see, you come in and you'd select the location. And then step three, do you want to save it as a JPEG? Do you want to save it as a Photoshop file? Or do you want to save it as a TIFF? For our demonstration today, we want to save us a JPEG. And the quality is at a 12, which would make, make that the highest quality. And for purposes of our demonstration today, we'll make that a 9. You could also resize it to fit exactly whatever size you wanted to. For our purpose today, the change into a quality of 9 will be just fine. Also, as you're changing these files, you have the ability to run an action that you have perhaps a vignette or any other action that you have. Again, though, for our purpose, we'll not do that today. So we've got our four files selected. We've got the location where we want them to end up as JPEGs and the size. So simply hit the Run button. And you see the files come up and are being saved as a JPEG. So now we can go back in and this was what a hundred plus megabyte we've now dropped it down to a nine megabyte a 66 megabyte has now become a 4.7 much more manageable files I hope this has helped for Willapon Photography this is Ricky Depriest.